Hi. Our topic is about describing the internal structure of the Earth. Let's start with the crust, which is the outermost layer of the Earth. The crust has two main parts, the continental crust and the oceanic crust. The continental crust, approximately 25 miles thick, is comprised of different kinds of rocks that make up the land. The oceanic crust, approximately 3 to 5 miles thick, is made up of rocks that are located at the bottom of oceans. The crust is composed of two kinds of rocks, granite and basalt. The continental plate is made up of granite, while oceanic plate is made up of basalt. Basalt is much denser than the granite, that's why continental crust ride on the denser oceanic plates. Moreover, the crust and the upper layer of the mantle make up the lithosphere. Also, the crust is also broken into many pieces called lithospheric plates. The image shows the major and minor lithospheric plates that we've already discussed in our previous lessons. The next part of the internal structure of the Earth is the mantle. It is the thickest layer of the Earth, and it is located below the crust. It comprises half of the Earth's mass. It is also made up of hot, dense, semi-solid rock. Moreover, mantle is composed of different parts. Asthenosphere, upper mantle, and lower mantle. The asthenosphere is the fluid layer of the mantle, where convection happens. The convection currents cause the movement of the crustal plates. We also have the upper mantle, and the lower mantle. The upper mantle is the layer next to the asthenosphere. This layer is hotter and more solid than the asthenosphere. On the other hand, the lower mantle is the densest and hottest layer of the mantle. There's a boundary between the crust and the mantle. It is called the Mohoravisic discontinuity. Now, let us talk about the core, which is the innermost layer of the Earth. It is divided into two parts, the outer core and the inner core. The outer core is a liquid layer about 2,260 kilometers thick. It is located below the mantle and above the inner core. It is composed of iron and nickel. Convection of liquid metals in the outer core creates the Earth's magnetic field. On the other hand, inner core is a solid sphere about 1,216 kilometers in radius. It is made of iron and nickel allow. Its temperature is similar to the sun's surface temperature. High pressure squeeze metals together and are not able to move about like a liquid, but are forced to vibrate in place like a solid. Here's the summary illustration of the internal structure of the Earth. This is the end of the presentation. Thank you.